Hello people, welcome back to my channel, How to Beat Eric Rosen. Today, before we get into the puzzle battle, let me just tell you about three factors you need which might actually heavily affect your puzzle battles. And I'm not kidding guys, like you can win many puzzle battles, you've just neglected these three things. So one factor is to check on your internet speed. As you can see, uh, you have to make sure you have a fast and stable internet speed. Of course, chess.com doesn't take up that much of internet, but uh, it's always good to have faster or a stable internet speed, okay? So I just checked mine then, it was around 10 to 13 Mbps, which is decent. And then another thing which you can do is to enable pre-moves. To enable pre-moves, you just have to go to settings and under live chess, you can just swipe the enable pre-moves option to on and your pre-moves are there. And lastly, you have to solve the really easy puzzles as quick as possible. Like no taking too much time on that. Okay, so let's go for today's puzzle battle. Yesterday, I had quite a bad loss against an underrated opponent. Let's see what I do today. Okay. Like as you can see, if you enable pre-moves, you can solve your puzzles much faster. Then. You saw that? Again. Okay, so he's done at 25 puzzles. Now you just gotta go for a high score. Like, you no, know, you need those season points, right? So, okay, up to 30 now. See pre moves, they matter a lot. <laughs> no, oh, I wanted to go rook F one and queen f2 mate but i mouse slipped and yeah you gotta avoid mouse slips as well well this was a good run i guess like 35 is my personal best i've done it once without making a mistake and this i've done with three mistakes it could have been a potential 36 well hope you enjoyed this video guys don't forget to like share and subscribe and thanks for watching